The Romanian Greek Catholic Church or Romanian Church United with Rome, Greek Catholic Romanian, Basarica Romana Unita Cu Roma, Greco-Catolica is a sui iuris Eastern Catholic Church, in full union with the Roman Catholic Church. It has the rank of a major archiepiscopal church and it uses the Byzantine liturgical rite in the Romanian language. Since 1994, Cardinal Lucian Marizan, Archbishop of Figueras and Alba Iulia, serves as head of the Romanian Greek Catholic Church. On December 16, 2005, as the Romanian Church united with Rome, Greek Catholic was elevated to the rank of a major archiepiscopal church by Benedict XVI. Lucian Marizan became its first major archbishop. Marizan was eventually created a cardinal, at the consistory of February 18, 2012. Besides the Archiparchy of Figueras and Alba Iulia, there are five more Greek Catholic eparchies in Romania Eparchy of Oradia Mare, Eparchy of Cluj Gerla, Eparchy of Lugoj, Eparchy of Marimers, and Eparchy of St. Basil the Great of Bucharest, as well as one eparchy overseas, the Romanian Catholic Eparchy of St. George's in Canton, answering directly to the Major Archbishop and the Holy See, in the United States of America and Canada. According to data published in the 2016 Annuario Pontificio, the Romanian Greek Greek Catholic Church had 504,280 members, 8 bishops, 1,225 parishes, some 835 diocesan priests and 235 seminarians of its own right at the end of 2012. However, according to the 2011 Romanian government census, the number of its followers living in Romania was as low as 150,593, of which 124,563 are ethnic Romanians. The dispute over this figure is mentioned in the United States Department of State report on religious freedom in Romania. In addition, there are five other Catholic dioceses in Romania, belonging to the Latin Church, whose members are more numerous. Topic: History. Topic. Following the Habsburg conquest of Transylvania in 1687, Metropolitan Atanasi Gel entered into full communion with the See of Rome by the Act of Union of 1698, that was formalized by a synod of bishops on September 4, 1700. By entering into the Union, Atanasi and the other bishops, along with their respective dioceses, accepted the supreme authority of the Pope, while at the same time being granted the right to keep their own Greek Byzantine liturgical rite. A diploma issued by the Emperor Leopold I declared that Transylvania's Romanian Orthodox Church is one with the Roman Catholic Church. Transylvanian Romanians were therefore encouraged to convert to Catholicism and join the newly created Greek Catholic Church, while being able to retain the Byzantine Rite, if at the same time they accepted four doctrinal points promulgated by the Council of Florence 1431 and 1445, the supreme authority of the Pope over the entire Church, the existence of purgatory, the filioque clause, and the validity of the use of unleavened bread in the celebration of the Eucharist in the Latin Church Eastern Orthodox had contended that Roman Catholic use of Unleavened bread was erroneous. The step undertaken by Metropolitan Atanasi Ain Gel and his Holy Synod obtained for the ethnic Romanians of Transylvania, then part of the Habsburg Empire, equal rights with those of the other Transylvanian nations, which were part of the Unio Trium Nationum, the Hungarian nobility, the Transylvanian Saxons, and the CK. This event coincided with the arrival of the Jesuits in Transylvania, who attempted to align this province more closely with Western Europe. However, most Romanians were not willing to convert, and this in turn led to the formation of Romanian Orthodox movements that advocated for freedom of worship for the entire Transylvanian population, most notable the movements led by Vissarion Sarai, Nicolae Opera Maclaus, and Sofrani of Chora, under the influence of the dominant Serbian Church. In 1721, the bishop's residence was moved from Alba Iulia to Figueras, and eventually to Blaj Following this change, Blaj became a center of learning and national awakening for all Romanians. In 1761, Petru Pavel Aaron (1709–1764), the Bishop of Figueras and head of the Romanian Greek Catholic Church, translated Biblia Vulgata into Romanian. While the Romanian Orthodox kept Church Slavonic as the official liturgical language till 1863, the Romanian Church united with Rome has been using the Romanian vernacular ever since its inception. In the 19th century, during a time when the Hungarian government was pursuing a Magyarization policy in Transylvania, the Romanian Greek Catholic Church, with the aid of the Transylvanian School and the Transylvanian Memorandum, played a prominent role in resisting ethnic assimilation attempts. 
Moreover, many leading figures of the Romanian emancipation movement in Transylvania, such as Simeon Barnatiu and Iuliu Maniu, began their careers as lay servants of the Greek Catholic Church. Additional Greek Catholic eparchies were eventually set up at Oradia 1777, as well as Gerla and Lugoj 1853. Blaj, under the title of Eparchy of Alba Iulia and Figueres, became the Metropolitan i.e. Archiepiscopal c. On December 16, 2005, the Romanian Greek Catholic Church was elevated to the rank of major archiepiscopal church. Topic: <laughs> Persecution under communism. Topic. After assuming political power in 1948, the communist regime, rooted in Marxist-Leninist atheism, deposed all twelve bishops of the Greek Catholic Church on Stalin's orders. Moreover, on October 21, 1948, the 250th anniversary of the Romanian Greek Catholic Union with the Roman Catholic Church, the regime arranged for the voluntary and spontaneous transfer of all members of the Greek Catholic Church decree 358-1948, that numbered some 1,500,000 at the time, to the Romanian Orthodox Church. Furthermore, the property rights over many of the Greek Catholic Church Church's possessions, including its four cathedrals, were transferred to the Romanian Orthodox Church, while the remainder of those properties were confiscated by the state. The Greek Catholic bishops, along with many of their priests, were accused by the newly installed communist authorities of anti democratic activity after refusing to give up their ties with the reactionary Holy See, they were imprisoned. At about the same time, the Orthodox Church was being purged of priests hostile to the communist regime. Following this purge, the Orthodox hierarchy enjoyed good relations with the communist authorities for the remainder of the communist rule of Romania. Iuliu Hasu, Bishop of Cluj, turned down a proposal of the Romanian Orthodox Patriarch, Iostinian Marina, to convert to Orthodoxy and be named Orthodox Archbishop of IAC and Metropolitan of Moldavia, and thereby become the official successor of the Romanian Orthodox Patriarch himself. Consequently, Hasu remained under house arrest. Year after year, he sent memorandums to the President of the Republic, requesting that the country's laws and international agreements be observed with regard to the Romanian Greek Catholic Church. In 1969, Pope Paul VI asked Hasu to accept an appointment to the Cardinalate. As Hasu was reluctant to leave his people, the Pope created him a Cardinal only, in pector, i.e., Without publishing the fact, that was only revealed on March 5, 1973, three years after Bishop Hasu's death. Another remarkable Romanian Greek Catholic ecclesiastic of the time was Alexandru Todia (1912–2002). Secretly, in Pector, consecrated as a titular bishop on November 19, 1950, he was arrested, and the following year he received a sentence of life in prison. He was granted amnesty in 1964. On March 14, 1990, after the fall of the communist regime, he was appointed Archbishop of Figueras and Alba Iulia, and was created a cardinal the following year. After more than 40 years of clandestine existence, the Romanian Church united with Rome, Greek Catholic re emerged publicly, in the wake of the Romanian Revolution. Normative Act 931, passed on December 31, 1989, repealed Decree 358-1948 that outlawed the Greek Catholic Church as repugnant and bringing grave prejudice upon the Romanian state. Only after much struggle and considerable delays, some of the Church's properties, in particular the cathedrals of Cluj, Blaj, Lugoj, and Oradia, were restored to their rightful owner. However, much of the original property remains in Romanian Orthodox or government hands, as the persecution started in 1948 has led to a marked reduction in the numbers of Romanian Greek Catholic faithful. After 40 years of communist rule and forced assimilation into the regime-approved Orthodox Church, numerous Romanian cradle Greek Catholics remained in the Romanian Orthodox Church, and it is unclear how many of these nominal Orthodox members remain crypto-Catholic, especially in northern Transylvania where most Greek Catholics lived, as shown on the maps to the right. The Romanian Catholic Church united with Rome is still undergoing a process of recovery from the wounds inflicted by the communist rulers and the forced merger. Topic. Property issues since the fall of communism Topic. 
Since the fall of communism, church leaders have claimed that the Romanian Greek Catholic community is facing a cultural and religious wipeout. The Greek Catholic churches are allegedly being destroyed by representatives of the Romanian Orthodox Church, whose actions allegedly enjoy not only the acceptance, but also the support of the Romanian authorities. Topic: Hierarchy. Topic: Ecclesiastical Province of Figueras and Alba Iulia, Romanian Catholic Archiparchy of Figueras and Alba Iulia, Romanian Catholic Eparchy of Oradea Mare, Romanian Catholic Eparchy of Cluj Gerla, Romanian Catholic Eparchy of Lugoj, Romanian Catholic Eparchy of Marimers, Romanian Catholic Eparchy of Saint Basil the Great of Bucharest, immediately subject to the Holy See. Romanian Catholic Eparchy of St. George's in Canton Topic. See also Topic. History of Catholicism in Romania Topic. References Topic. Topic. External links Topic. Basarica Romana Unita Cu Roma, Greco-Catolica, in Romanian.